I met Jacko in Miami a couple of times. He would come to see us whenever we played there. And um, we stuck up a friendship, and uh, he liked the way I play, although I play in a completely different way. He appreciated what I do, and I was obviously a huge, a huge fan of his. So you know, I think he was as, as um, influential on that instrument as, say, Hendrix was for the electric guitar, completely reinventing its possibilities. And uh, you know, it begs the, the, the imponderable "what if." You know, what if Jacko had lived to this time and reached 60? There's no telling what that, that musical mind would have, would have done. You know, he was an extraordinary musician and a lovely human being. I think there's too much said about this crazy Jacko. We're all crazy. We're all crazy. I'm appalled by the, the way he died. But, um, you know, he should be remembered for his musicianship and his, his uh, inspiration.